So I caught this seagull trying to get in our chicken hutch. Oh my god, he caught the rooster, Please guys. Don't lie. You have, you have yeah, I don't know how he managed to catch this rooster. Be careful, make sure you don't let him go. He's actually here. he's actually very nice and trust me, he didn't even bite me. He's like, so crazy, yeah. I, I screamed as if he was gonna let him go out of my room. That's so See, crazy. You gotta handle this thing so he's nice to you when this he thing. goes. <laughs> yeah, we do need to handle him. So it makes things easier if we need to catch him for something. He's okay, heavy. So I want to show you the Christmas tree that we got this year. It's a fake one. I did plan to get a real one, but we didn't get around to it. And kind of makes sense since me and my brother won't be home for Christmas. We'll be in California. And yeah, just my mom and stepdad will be home. So yeah, it makes sense to not buy a real one if we're not going to be here, especially the fact that I love real Christmas trees. So let's start. It's a six foot tree. It's like a very skinny one, very um, slim. You know, it's not like a fat tree. I do love those fat, huge trees, but we don't have the house and the space for it. So this is what we're using right now. The lights are put on very tacky, guys. It's hard putting lights around a Christmas tree, especially if you don't have enough lights to cover up the whole tree. So these were the new ones that we just bought uh, from Myers, the lights, and we just put them on. We only bought two boxes. Probably should have bought like two more, but whatever. Like I said, we're not going to be here. At least me. I'm not going to be here for the holidays. So we didn't go much crazy this year. But at the top, as you can see, we have the star that we've had for quite a few years now. This tree right here. I love this little ornament. We got that at the Dollar Tree, actually. Some of these were from the Dollar Tree, like the cute sparkly one there, too. And the rest are just ornaments we've had from years now. It's been quite a while. I actually love the ornaments at the Dollar Tree because, like, look at this. This is extremely cute. I went for a lot of gray and white things because, like I said, I wanted to get a live tree and do a whole different setup on it. But we aren't doing that this year, so we'll do it next year. And I plan to invest in buying a tree for us. A, a one that's like this but has fake snow on it, you know. I don't know what they call that. But it... It's very beautiful. It looks really nice. I've seen the pictures on Amazon. And then we've got these cute little things. Let's see if I can find my favorite ornament and show you guys it. It's gonna be hard to find it though. Oh, and we have these cute little balls hanging on the windows. They've fallen, so Let's see. They're, cause they're little ornaments, but yeah. So you can see all these ornaments we have. We have these ones. Like I said, next year I'm going to try and find more gray and acorn and natural looking ornaments. Kind of like that. That's cute. So I can have it be a, a certain setup, you know, instead of a whole bunch of random things. Oh, I found my favorite one. This one. We got it from the dollar store, guys. This cute little thing from the dollar store beautiful if you don't want to spend a lot of money on ornaments I suggest going to the dollar store we've got the simple ones there's my cat always trying to be a attention stealer now look at that tell me this isn't cute I can't wait for the next year to put these on the white tree that I've been dreaming of ordering and getting so like I said the lights are not put on correctly. They're kind of missing around here, especially down here, as you can see. You can see where there's a lot of lights missing. It's just back there. It's just, um, I keep saying it's just, it's a lot of work to decorate it. How's your goodie doing? Hmm? So, again, let's have a closer look. Look at that beautifulness. Oh, and I love these. I think I'm going to keep these for next year and put them on also. Because they're like cute little apples. It would be really cute on a white tree. I 
And I love this too. So we just have a whole bunch of random ornaments. It's cute though, I mean, you know, it does the job. The tree is really see-through that I don't I don't like personally, but whatever. Hopefully next year I will get us a different one and it'll be fake. I like I like real trees, but I'm starting to think about it. It's you know, cutting down a tree just for one year use is not it's not nice. I like that at all. We'll see. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this little video and let me know what you guys think of my Christmas tree. Okay guys, so I'm gonna pour some water on here. So it's kind of hard to get an angle in here and film this. I probably could have gotten my car mount and mounted it somewhere, maybe on the car wall. This, he's not having it. So the next step that I'll be doing is I'll be spraying some of this flea spray onto his coat, just like that. Sorry guys, it's really dark in this bathroom sometimes, and the angle over here is really awkward. So I'll just be spraying that around him. Try not to get it on his face, of course. Anywhere where it could be sensitive. Right, Zeus? Look at him, guys. He's already dying to get out. Calm down, Zeus. Relax, okay? He'll be a good boy for me. If I can open the, his shampoo, and then after that, I'll be putting some of the shampoo. I don't have conditioner, which is fine. He doesn't need it. But here he is. And then I'll just be going with this, mixing it all together, and getting him all soaked up. He likes his butt scratched right there. Hi, Zuzi. Stop acting so impatient. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna scrub him, guys, and I'll show you him all scrubbed up. All ready for the shampoo part. By the way, that was not a fart. Just so, so you there's know. the water, and I'm just gonna let him sit here for a little bit or stand while I let the flea matter, the flea spray kind of get into his coat since he's all shampooed. Doesn't look like it, but he is pretty good. Look at that. Yep. Zeus, are you ready? I just finished washing Zeus, and now it's Junior's turn. Junior, are you ready? You ready for a wash? Are you ready for a little bath? He's like, nope. Good boy. Got in all by himself. Did you mighty boy? Oh, I know, I know. You're huge compared to Zeus in here. Let's take a look. <laughs> Stay. So I was doing about it. spraying some of this on him. I already sprayed some, but you know, just a simple spray. Make sure you don't get it in their face or their genital areas, I guess. Then I'm just using this scrubber, whatever, to scrub it into the coat. I use this for Zeus too, which is actually pretty nice versus scrubbing it with my hands. This does about a better job, I feel like. So I'm just going to scrub him out. And then I'm going to rinse a little bit of water on him and then to do the shampoo. So look at the biggest liner. Stay. Mm -mm. Do you think whining is going to get you out of situations? No. Look who's okay. here to help me pack. Are you helping me? Are you just gonna look? Oh, I wish I could put you in this suitcase and take you with me. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. You good boy. Alright, so I'm packing for California. I didn't pack too much because I don't think I need a lot. I'm not gonna be staying there for a long time. Just a couple days. But, of course, bras. You need a bras. And I bought, I'm thinking I'm gonna bring a sports bra just in case. I don't know. Whatever. My makeup bag. It's not a lot in here, which is really nice. And a couple of things. So I think this will be it. We'll be, I believe, in, in Tahoe most of the time. So I kind of dressed, I packed more for a colder weather. And I think the weather is going to be like here in Washington. So I just pretty much packed what I would wear here. And then I bought some tank tops or whatever just to wear around the house. Or whatever you would call it. And some pajamas and then a skirt just in case. I don't know, just bought one just in case I might need it. And... I'll be taking three pairs of pants, got my scarf, and I also got my new boots that I got for there. My mom got them for my birthday, actually, so thank you, mom. 
just some boots to wear when I go there. Um, yeah, so that's that for this suitcase, or for my thing. And also on the top here is just underwear and socks, and then here is just tampons and pads. Because I feel like the second I step there, I'm going to probably get my period. Like, not the second, but the second, or a day or two before I leave, I feel like. Like, I don't know, my period just loves to come during the worst time ever. And I'm going to be debating on if I want to bring another pair of shoes or what's going to be going on. But the suitcase is pretty light, which I like. You know, it's not heavy. Oh, and I cannot forget my hair straightener. Junior, I think he wants to come in. You want to come in? He's like, um, yeah. You going to be a good boy for me, handsome? So, yeah, I gave you a bath. How do you feel? Even though you already dirtied yourself outside. You're just a dirty little boy, huh? Oh. You're a good boy. So, yeah, and I'll be um, probably getting that jacket and uh, another jacket, and we'll be all set to go. Um, guys, I hope my airplane flight goes good. I don't I'm know what I feel nervous is, about but... my flight. Gosh, look at this hair. This looks like I literally got electrocuted. I'm going to have to take another shower. I took a shower yesterday, I took a bath, and then I'm going to take another shower because I look freaky, like freaky freakster. So... Well, I think our flight's around 6 p.m. or so. Um, yeah, I guess I'll show you guys what I, I pack when I'm done. Rooster. He's He was chasing the tiny birds. Look, look, look. I don't know if he'll do it now. Why is it the second I film, he's like not doing it? But he's gotten really tougher, guys. Um, I don't know what it is, but he, two of the chickens over there, two of the brown ones, tried to gang up on him, and he did not take that. See, look at him chasing that. He did not take it. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> he is crazy. It's crazy, guy. He's getting there. Oh, look at that! Just because I opened the door, they all want to rush here. I should drop something for them to eat. Oh, oh, okay. I'm so surprised that they don't jump over that fence. It's a good thing though. Or that they don't jump over this fence to get to the dog side. I don't know. I could do like a back backyard video one day and show you guys that the dog side is over here. Junior, stop. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna miss these um, chickens and the rooster. Junior. I think I should throw something to them since they're all here. Chicken, I don't know, chicken, guys. Chicks. With that being said, um, my hair, like I said, is looking hot mess. I'm gonna have to get my straightener and straighten it today before I leave for tomorrow and oh god this is a, this is not funny this is like some scarecrow hair and then um yeah I guess I'm just waiting for my food or the stove to like beep so I can put some food in because I'm hungry did I say stove oven sorry I'm gonna miss this but, yeah. ball junior oh hi well hello there you're such a friendly guy sometimes huh just kidding, you're always friendly. Zeus, on the other hand, is not. What the hell are you doing? Boy, get down. Get down. Oh, I gotta make sure I don't forget my purse that I'm going to need. There's Zeus couch potato, as always. Zeus, you wanna go for a walk? Do you wanna be a couch potato? Let's go ask. So, this is a tree, by the way, guys. During the um, light or whatever, I just wanted to show you. Look how fucking see through this is. Part of my French, but I hate this tree. It's like a Charlie Brown tree. I mean, I like how it's like slim and the size of it is perfect. But the fact that you can see through it is like, ugh. sorry, I scared everybody, but that's just ugly. So hopefully, um, sometime next year, I'll just buy us a different one. Um, I want to buy, like I said, a fake tree with like snow. I, I don't know what they call them. I can't think of the names, but it has like fake snow or whatever. So it looks more like it's in a snowy place it's really pretty it's about the same size as this i believe what is this guy doing hey 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 don't be a naughty boy okay junior you gotta be careful with him though because he eats socks so yeah oh and we have this christmas thing guys i don't know if i showed this but look at that it's beautiful it does light up um we don't have it on right now it used to be over there but then we got that ghetto tree this year it's gonna be temporary believe me i'm not gonna keep that forever Hopefully I'll be moved out by then, but who knows. Um, yeah, this is a tree for it. I filled up my fish tank up a little bit higher to there, so that when I leave, it's, it doesn't go any lower. My parents will be home, though, so they'll be taking care of the pets for me. I'm so thankful. <sighs> and when I get back, um, hopefully then my mom can go somewhere. 
with uh, my stepdad and then I can be home and watch the house and watch the pets. Um, guys, I want to show you this. Oh.